Welcome, today we've got a great cardio Tabata style class for you, no equipment needed. My name is Brad Boggs, I'm the owner of Benefitness. Fitness. This is my wife, Corey, the lead trainer at Benefit Fitness. Benefit Fitness, we're a corporate wellness company based in Portland, Oregon. Here on YouTube, we do 30 minute workouts, 10 minute workouts. We also do nutritional tips and tricks, so definitely check out our other, our other videos. Let's jump right into the workout. All right, you guys, let's start. We're just gonna do about 15 seconds, just some side taps, shaking it out. Shake out that body. Having a great cardio. Getting wake, wake up the body from the weekend. Yep, okay, now outstretch those arms, stop those feet, and windmill. Down and up, send those hips back, look up at your hand. Getting ready. We have our Tabata style class today. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, four times. I'll go over all that in a little bit. Two more. Good, and now let's forward lunge and twist. Forward lunge, twist over that forward leg, and back. Forward lunge, get that back knee close to the ground, twist over that forward leg, and back. When you forward lunge, you can let your knee rest, or you can let it hover. Nice big twist, and back. Good, and twist. Warming up that body. Let's do two more. And we're gonna do our forward folds to our inchworm. So forward fold, stretch those hamstrings, walk it out. Send those hips down, shine that chest up. When you're here, shoulders away from your ears, puff up that chest, squeeze your booty. Hips back high, walk it in. Forward fold, we'll do three. Chest up. Don't let those shoulders come to your ears, keep them away. Last one, after you send your hips down, chest up, stay in your plank position. Then step your right foot outside your right hand, Shift your weight forward, and then back to plank position. Left foot outside, left hand, and plank, right. Really open those hips, plank, left. Shift your weight forward, plank, two more, right. Plank, and left. Plank, hips high, downward dog. Walk it all the way in. All right, you guys, we're gonna start two exercises, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, four times, four minutes of work. We're gonna start with a little bit of lower body burn. So we're gonna get into a lunge position. We're gonna lunge, and we're gonna crawl forward. We're gonna crawl back, forward, and back. 20 seconds on one leg, we're gonna burn. Second exercise, we're gonna step wide, and we're just gonna shift right and left, right and left, setting those hips back. And then we'll go to the other leg, same thing. We're just gonna burn out those legs, first four minutes. All right, we ready? You guys all ready? Forward, backward lunges. So get that right leg forward. Everybody, right leg forward. Come back into that lunge position. You're gonna keep this leg here. You're lunging, creeping forward. Lunge, creep forward. When I creep forward, my knees almost come to one another, but notice I'm on my tiptoe. Lunge, creep forward. This low, stay low. First round, you're gonna burn. Low, stay low, stay low. All right, everybody stand up. Now you're gonna widen those legs. And we're gonna feel a nice stretch to your inner thighs. We're gonna go low, push low. Back and forth, big chest. Okay, burn out those legs. Back and forth. If you wanna raise that toe up, raise that toe up. You're not standing all the way up. Stay no, low. we're sliding and sliding. Good, slide and slide. Five seconds. Push side to side, push. So here I'm pushing that off the right, and I'm pushing again. Okay, now your left leg forward, guys. Left leg. So again, I'm not standing all the way up. I'm here, and I'm bringing my knee to meet each other on my tiptoe. Back, tiptoe, back, tiptoe. We are burning it out. I think my heart's already climbing, even though I'm doing no jumping. In five. Good, two, one, stand it up. All right, you guys, wide legs, wide legs. Get ready. So I'm pushing with this to slide. And then I'm pushing to slide, staying low. Sitting into this heel, you're gonna feel a nice stretch through those hips. Big chest, draw your belly in to the back of your spine. Protect that low back. We have five seconds. 
Sit lower if you can. Sit lower and lower. Woo! Hips are feeling it. All right, let's go. Back to your right leg, folks. Back to your right leg. All right, down and crawl and back. So this back leg should not be taking much of your weight. It should basically be just a little bit of a kickstand. Think about 70% here, 30% back here. Come on, five seconds. You should be burning. Good. Brad gave that like, this is hard look. This is hard. Okay, widen those legs. All right, get low. So if you wanna sit lower, you can sit lower and push, sit lower. Or you can just kind of slide and slide. Sit. 10 seconds. Good. And five, push. Big chest, Brad. Big chest, folks. Come on, you've got it, that's it, see? All right, one more on each side. One more beach exercise. Left leg forward. Remember, 70% here. This is just a little kickstand. In, back out. In, back out. Keep your weight up in this leg. Load up that heel. Whew. 10 seconds. Come on, don't come out of it. Stay low, stay low. Get it done. Whew. All right, out. Widen those legs. Last 20 seconds. Then our next circuit, we, I'll get your heart rate up a little bit more, if that's what you so desire. Down, push, side to side. Stay low. Push, 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 push. We've got cheerleaders. She's telling Brad he's not working hard enough. Yeah. And I'm not focused. Make mommy and daddy work harder. Two, one. All right, shake it out, shake it out. We have two more exercises. All right, two exercises. We're gonna do a burpee jack. So you're gonna drop down into your burpee, out and in from here, out and in. So drop into your burpee, feet narrow, feet wide. So again, we're staying low. We're really burning out that lower body. Second exercise, so push-ups. We're just gonna come down into our push-up position. You're gonna give me a push-up, 20 seconds. See as many as you can do. Actually, I encourage you to count how many push-ups you do the first round. Try to meet that amount of push-ups every time. Try it out, see how you do. All right, you guys, 20 seconds of burpee jacks in five. So just a normal burpee dropping down. And then when you come in, staying low, out and in. Out and in, stay low. Sit to those heels, 10 seconds. Come on, move faster, you guys. The first round, a little bit more of a burnout. Now we're gonna get that heart rate up with this first exercise. All right, get down to the ground. I encourage you to count your push-ups. If you can't do ground push-ups, come to your knees or come to an incline. Ready and go. Knock it out, come on. Make them good though. Don't get sloppy, make sure your elbows are back about 45 degrees. Chest reaches for the ground first. Don't let those hips drop. Whew, almost there, three, two, one. All right, did you count? I hope you counted. You're gonna try to meet that next time. Meet or beat it. Ready and burpees, set and go. Out and in, out and in. Plank position, perfect. Nice wide step jumps. 10 seconds. Come on, you can do it. Perfect plank when you jump out from that burpee position. Right. Push up. You know how many you did? Do it again. All right, go. Come on. You can do it. Keep pushing. Push those push ups all the way up. Come on, Brad, you've got it. All right, halfway, get back up, move and groove. On your marks, three, two, one, and go. Let's do it. Stay low in that out and in. Perfect plank. Let's go, you guys. 
eight seconds. Give me one more good one. One. All right. Halfway, halfway. Come on, drag it down to these push-ups. She knows how to take care of herself. Let's push up. Come on, you guys. Keep that chin tucked back. If you need to hold plank, hold plank for a second. Get after it. Woo! All right, one more set. 20 seconds each. Right, one more, one more. Yep, that's it. Come on, get ready and go. Out and in, jack. Out and in, jack. Come on, you can do it. Push yourself. Go a little bit faster. Perfect. That's it, you guys. Three, two, last one. Woo! Get down to the ground. Let's do our push ups. Let's go, push ups. Knock it out. This is your last set. Come on. If you have to hold that plank position, just hold it. But don't get out of your plank position. If you need to come to your knees to wrap a few more out. Come to your knees. Woo! Good work, you guys. Give water. We have two more exercises. Next two exercises. It's fine. Yep. We're going back to our plank position on our forearms, working our shoulders, our upper body a little bit more. We've done these plenty of times for those of you who have taken our classes. Plank position, up, down, plank. I want you to press up with the right, down with the right for the entire 20 seconds. When you come back the second time, you'll do your left for the entire 20 seconds. That's first exercise, second exercise. We're gonna go forward and backward, funny jump, squat jumps. So feet together, we're gonna jump forward, wide, jump back in, jump backwards, wide, jump back in. So you're kind of making an X with your body. Okay, if you're not into impact, by all means, just step forward, wide, step narrow, wide, step backwards, wide. So you're almost making like this crisscross X. Got it? Down on those elbows. Everybody press up with your right for the first 20 seconds. We're gonna burn out the right side, left for the second 20 seconds. We need to come back around for the second time. Forearms, please, everybody. Get on those forearms. Press up with the right. After those push-ups, this is gonna be a little tiresome. Up with the right, down with the right. Up with the right, down with the right. If you feel like your hips are moving and grooving a little too much, widen those legs. If you want to make it harder, put those feet close together. You have five seconds. Right, left, right, left. Keep going. All right. Okay, up. So everybody start with your feet together. You're going to jump forward. Say, hey, everybody. Jump back. And then jump backwards again to close. So forward, out, forward, back. Middle, out, middle, back. Middle, out. Middle, back. If you want to find your rhythm, do a little hand movement. That's fun, too. If you hate jumping, you can just quickly step forward, jump wide. Step forward, step wide. If you don't want to do the impact, just, just step forward and backwards. Quickly, though. Everybody, left elbows. Left leads the way. Up with the left. Down with the left. The left leads the way as you press up. Always pressing up with the left. Oh, I was doing my right. As I say left, I was doing my right. I don't know my differences. Woo. It's funny how I say something and do the opposite. All right, get ready. So again, if you hate that impact, you can step wide, step narrow, step wide. Okay. Narrow, wide, narrow, wide, narrow. Find your rhythm. Five seconds, rock and roll. All right, back down. Right arm this time, you guys. Lead with the right, the entire 20 seconds. Get ready, and go, you guys, come on. 20 seconds, lead the way, right leads the way.
we're halfway through this round of four minutes. Stay strong. All right. Up, up, up. Good job, girly. Wide, narrow, wide, narrow. Forward, back. Forward, back. Good. Just have fun with it. Find your rhythm. Woo! Three, two, one, and rest. Last one with the left. Last one. Come on, you guys, get down. On your forearms, on your marks, and go. Up with the left, down. Lead with the left. Come on, you can do it. Push yourselves. Woo, last 20. When I get tired, you can tell my crazy hair starts coming out. Woo, forward and back to wide, narrow, wide, narrow, forward, back. Move and groove. Five seconds. Three. And there you go. Nice job, you guys. Grab a drink of water if you need. All right, we're going back down into our plank position. A little bit more core focused. First, we're going to do oblique plank jumps. So I want you to start in your tabletop position. You're going to jump your feet to the right side of your body. Back to tabletop position. Jump your feet to the left side of your body. Tabletop. Right. Notice that my legs are straight, though when I jump out to the right. So I'm on an oblique plank, and then move back to tabletop, then back to the other side, okay? First exercise second is a double bicycle. So you're going to bring one knee in, your elbow to your knee, come back out, elbow to knee, out, switch. Elbow knee goes twice, switch. Elbow knee twice, switch. Switch. So we're really focusing on that core engagement as we Go elbow to knee, and then we'll flip back over. So you're gonna feel this in your abs this round. All right, you guys, down into your tabletop position. Start with hands right under your shoulders, knees right under your hips. Start in that position for me. Then you're gonna jump your feet to the right. You'll jump back to tabletop position, and then jump your feet to the left. So it's not too far out. So that's just about your inside foot is almost lined up on the outside of that hand. But always jump right into that tabletop position, side. If you need to slow it down, you can slow it down to find that positioning. All right, everybody into your bicycle position. Let me go this way. So elbow knee, keep that out leg, other leg straight out. Come back out, elbow knee, and then you switch as your elbows and knees touch. So it's just like a double elbow knee touch. Keep that back flat on the ground. If you need to let this other leg not fully extend out, you can have it up higher. If this is too much, keeping it hovered, you can keep it higher and go like so. So notice my legs are like so if you need. Okay, up, up. Onto your tabletop, in and out. Tabletop obliques, tabletop obliques. I feel like I'm gonna hit you, Brad. I'm gonna come to the side. Come on, you guys. That's a little bit too much of a challenge to jump. Just step back to tabletop, step to the other side, tabletop. So if you don't wanna jump or you feel it in your knees, you can just step to the side. If anybody needs to look and see my modification, that would be just fine. So elbow knee, elbow knee, and then as you switch, touch your elbow knee, and then two of them. Nice control, this is not about speed too much here. You stay focused, it should be hard because you're making it hard, not because you're just moving in and out, in and out, in and out so fast. Halfway, two more minutes, tabletop. 
out, in. Make sure your shoulders stay stacked over your wrists the whole time. You should not be back like this and your butt should not be up in the air. Straight line with those arms the whole time. Come on, you can do it. There we go, on the ground. Okay, so tuck that pelvis under. Hands stay loosely by your ears. Don't grab hold of your neck. What was that, girly? She's learned how to drink out of her sippy cup. Not that you guys all want to know that, but she's so excited she's using it. Come on, you guys, let's go. Woo, one more time. Start in your tabletop. Knees under hips, shoulders stay over your wrist the whole time, please. If you need a step, step or jump it out. Push that floor away. Try to look directly between your thumbs. Don't look down at your knees. That's gonna crane your neck. Don't look up in front of you. Look straight down. Woo, last one. Get down, you guys. Hands behind your ears. Loosely, don't pull, don't pull, please. One, two, switch. If you can, keep that leg straight, keep that other leg straight. If you need to keep it higher into the sky, keep it higher into the sky like so. It's up to you. Woo! All right, you guys, nice job. You'd like to think you're done, but you're not. So this eight minutes, I want you to go nonstop. It's an endurance round. Find what you can do to keep moving. We're gonna do each exercise one more time. 45 seconds with a 15 second rest. Starting with our lunge pulses, I will tell us to switch halfway through. Okay, so everybody get back. Brad's making sure baby is okay for the next eight minutes. So we're starting, remember, crawling forward, in and out, okay? 22 seconds on one leg, I'll tell you to switch halfway. Get ready, last eight minutes of work, right to the end. Okay, get back, right leg forward, and forward and back, out and in. Come on, load it up. 45 seconds, double the amount of time that we were doing before. The goal is to just keep moving. You have to modify, modify, but we're gonna keep going for 45 seconds. Stay lower, stay lower, and lower. Don't come out of this, it should burn. One, and switch legs, come on, get down. In and out, big chest. Show your shirt to the screen. Please don't round forward, big chest. Come on, out and in, tap it. This should be burning. Don't come out of it, stay low, stay low, you guys. Come on, you can do it. I know Brad's struggling. I bet you are too. Two, one. All right, 15 seconds. These are slides. Lateral split squats, back and forth. If you wanna get low, get low. If you need to stop here, stop here. Three, two, one, and go. Side to side. 45 seconds, if you do get tired, you can come up, squat, up, split squat. If you need, or please just stay low, slide, 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 work those hips. 30 seconds, good work you guys. Nice job, we're halfway, come on, you can do this. We're all doing it, draw that torso in. You may start feeling your back if you're not tense and keeping that core engagement. Kind of like I'm gonna come right up under you and sucker punch that gut. Keep it strong, not just sucked in. Keep it strong. Five seconds. Push. Three, two, one. All right, you guys, burpee jacks. We've got our burpees. So remember, out and in, out and in. If you need to drop down, step out, step in, tap wide and out, that works too. Find what you can do. The goal is to keep moving for 45 seconds. Whatever your level is, that is the best level to be at. Just push yourself. 30 seconds. We're doing it all together. Come on, keep it going. 20. You've done them for 20 before, you can do it again. 18. 
Come on, you've got it, guys. 10 seconds. Five. Two. One. Woo. Oh, we got push ups. 45 seconds of push ups is going to be a lot. So if you need to come to your knees or come to an incline to finish, do it, but try to just keep moving. Keep raising that incline if you can, or come to your knees, 45 seconds. Find your rhythm. Whew. Come on, you guys. The goal is to knock out reps. If you need to come to your knees, please do, so you can keep going. If you need to come to an incline, even an incline on your knees, that's great too. Or an incline in a plank. Keep going. We have 15 seconds. Keep it up. Remember, you are a moving plank. So don't let that butt creep towards the sky. Don't let those hips sink down. Focus on your core as you go up and down. Woo! Good thing those push-ups are done. All right, you guys, back down on your forearms. More arms, up, down, planks. Lead with the right for the halfway. I will tell you to switch, lead with the left. And two, one, and go. Up with the right, down with the right. This is a lot. It's gonna be intense right after those push-ups, but that was the goal. 22 seconds on one side, 22 on the other. Giving you a couple, one second to transition. Come on, keep it going. Place your hand right under your shoulder when you press up. Okay, switch sides. Left, lead with the left. Come on, you can do this. If you need to come to your knees to do it, come to your knees. There's no shame. We want everybody to just keep moving right now. That's what this round is all about, to keep moving. It's an endurance round. That's it. Woo. All right, you guys, back up. We're doing our forward, backward jumps. So our little X's, little flail those arms out side to side. You ready? We're sweating. Okay, out and back. Making an X with your body, with those feet. Find your rhythm. If this is too much on your knees, you hate the impact. Some people hate impact, I understand. Just move fast, making an X with those feet. You kind of find a little dance. That works well too. In and out. Try to sit in those heels, especially on that forward jump. If you can on the backwards jump, that's great too. 10 seconds. And we only have two more exercises. We only have two more minutes after this. Three, two, one. Woo! Yeah, she's so excited, we're almost done. Plank position, we're doing, or I'm sorry, not plank, tabletop. We're doing our oblique planks. So start knees under hips, shoulder, wrists under shoulders. All right, and go. Oblique, center, oblique, straight line, center. If that's too much, step, tap. Just step, tap those feet in each direction. We're almost there, you guys. Find it, keep going. You are halfway through this 45 seconds. Push that floor away, try to look directly between those fingers. I have a tendency to wanna to look down at my feet too. Try not to, look straight, down. We're almost done. You have five. Woo! Last 45 seconds, you guys. Last 45. Yeah, we're almost done. All right, you guys, stay focused. Good quality control. Burn out those abs. And go. So two elbow knees, switch. Two elbow knees, switch. Keep those ribs tucked down. Don't arch that low back. If you feel too much tension in your low back, it's working right now, bring those legs up, straight up, straight up. If you feel it in your low back, legs straight up or keep that extended out. We only have 15 seconds left. 
You can do it. Almost there. Eight. And five. Come on, finish strong. Don't stop. Two, one. And now you can collapse done. Woo. Good job, you guys. Awesome, thanks for joining us. Good job. Thank you for working out with us. My shoulders are tired, my thighs are tired. I even feel it in my core a little bit. I think he does too. But anyways, that was so great. Remember to subscribe to our channel. We always have this fun stuff going on for you. Like this video if you really did and leave feedback because we'd love to hear what you have to say. Don't mind our baby. Don't mind our baby. She's our cheerleader. She can be your cheerleader too if you watch it. Multiple times you hear her, we hear her. Anyways, we look forward to seeing you guys again. Come back soon.